Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day. A rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. This is the Allianz Parque, home of Palmeiras since 2014, and a very good-looking home to boot. It's a friendly in theory, but we are expecting this to be fiercely contested. I'm sitting here, Peter, thinking, is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances? This exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry. To me, it also has the same feel to it. And I'm pretty sure we can look forward to what will be a combative, high-intensity affair. We can't really say anything negative about this. And if it is full-on, then I'll be happy to watch that. And we're underway. Felipe Melo. Felipe Melo goes looking. It's got paid to a promising move. It's Wagner Love out to the right. Played in with accuracy. He's made sure that that won't get through. Can't get the better of his opposite number. The question that's a foul. Fence has got rid of that. Palmeiras have opted to really stretch the game now. Oh, that's pretty happy. And the finish! Oh, good take. And he's gone for it. Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. They're just lacking the cutting edge, Peter. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. Massive leap. Away from immediate danger. Could be a chip, he's had a shot! Felipe Melo. Tries to get it forward quickly. If you have just joined us, you'll be glad to know that you haven't missed a goal. Been repelled. He'll have a go. No, not quite. Corinthians really have been deserted by their composure and allowed frustration to take over, and it's not a good sign. Drives it towards the front. Lucas Lima. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. 
Enrique. And it's Wagner Love. Wagner Love gets it out to the wing. Wagner. And that's the whistle for half time. And both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Way to review the first half. Yeah, and despite the scoreline, it's clear who the better side is when it comes to chances. If this is the trend that's going to continue, then there's only going to be one winner here, and uh, I don't think it's going to take too much improvement for it to happen. After 45 minutes, it is still goalless. Change, perhaps. He's gone for it! Shots off target. Ball. And he's there to clear it. Lucas Lee hoists it forward. What a throw in. Brushed off the ball there. Enrique. Well into the second half, and still there's nothing between them. Fagner. And it's played forward. Clears it out of harm's way. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Corinthians seem to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was easily read and dealt with. Felipe Melo. Lovely bit of skill. Now it's Adriano. Shoots! Sticks it away! That could turn out to be a huge, huge goal! No space, no problem. You just cannot stop him. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, no, oh, you've got it, no, you don't, will you? So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who is going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag. Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. I think the danger for them now is fatigue. I think when the body tires, the mind soon follows. So concentration is key from here. Corinthians to make one last surge forward. Chance to break. Adriano. And the referee brings it to a close. So it ends 1-0. An enthralling game and an agonizingly narrow defeat. The end of the game. Reflections. And we know that derbies can often make predictions look silly. They can take on a, a personality of their own. And so just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.